Hey everybody, this is Gaming World of Anum. Welcome back to some more Night in the Woods. Last time we did one last hanging with Bay, but in this episode we're gonna be hanging out with another person. So I said I could like take you off to the park. You did indeed. I'm so tired. You gonna be okay? Yeah, I'll be fine. You off for this park trip? Yeah. I'm excited. Or are you? Yeah, we never get to hang out. Go something with Angus. So you think the guy you saw was a ghost? Not a guy, a ghost. Right. I just don't believe me that it was a ghost. Well, I mean, ghosts don't actually exist. I'm pretty sure they do. Well, I need evidence. What counts? A ghost walking up and saying hello. That means saying, hey, I verified you already did, person. Could be a zombie or a Frankenstein. Okay, maybe a third, maybe, maybe the ghosty stuff. I guess I can give you our podcast about ghosts. This episode of Ghosty Stuff brought to you by Donut Wolf. Look at the ghostly stuff. I'm May, and I saw a ghost, and this thing is who doesn't believe me. I mean, isn't this May? She's a crazy person. <laughs> There's evening. Yeah, it's alright. What was to take uh, up myself here to play Frisbee? I got into tea for the first few months. Full speed. Jeez. Can you see me ever throwing things at each other's heads? Oh. You saw that at the first thing. Posted. Do not feed or touch the wildlife. Oh, clearly. There's some folks living in cabins up here. You can, uh, feed and touch them if you want. It's a weird old place. It's a weird old place up here. We're all kind of weird stuff back up in the park. Most of just hanging out in the woods. We'll have my old scout camp on the way up, I think. Busy woods. We'll get very going before it gets dark. God has is all. So he got away from me. Uh Do you have an nail? Yeah, but I saved that for emergencies. Please know it's an emergency. What is this thing? This is like a lime clin, I think. Clinin? Like a furnace. Oh, furnace for what? Limestone. Like do something with it in there and it becomes this other thing. Oh. Well, this was weird because it's mostly made of skeletons of sea creatures. From millions of years ago. So, like, it's all underwater or something at some one point. Wow. I know, right? Like, why are we ever standing? There were, like, ancient horrible sea monsters. Creepy and awesome. <laughs> That's history. Okay, I'm ready to go. Hey, another one. <sighs> Phew. Need to take a break? I'm okay, I'm okay. No problem. <sighs> so, if this place was underwater. Where'd the water go? I don't know, to the ocean, I guess. I like, the earth is always shifting, so mountains get all pushed up. Or it used to be just flat ground. Because <laughs> things are so boring nowadays. I think, like, all that crazy stuff is going on here. There's always more weird stuff that happened. To find out about later. Okay, I'm ready to go. Cool, cool. <sighs> Are you sure you're okay? Yeah. <sighs> Sorry. Seriously, it's fine. Hang for a minute. Okay. I should know all this stuff about agent sea creature rock or whatever. Live stone. I was gonna take class in dinosaurs back at school. What happened? It was all full up. That class fills up fast. I bet. <laughs> dinosaurs are like the most interesting animals. You know they have feathers? Or some of them? I know, right? Big freaky chickens. Things were so scary and cool back then. We'd die in like five minutes. <laughs> oh yeah, ancient creatures would eat us no problem. We clapped for the millions of years between us. 
Weird. Time, dude. Time is most dangerous things, less dangerous. Most things, at least. Are you ready to roll? Yeah, we're all to the top. Well, that was a hike. I was a lot easier, a lot easier when I was 11. I was what, three gates on the way up here? I lost count. We were just few open back then. Hmm. Ready to go? Not far now, just up ahead. Graves, huh? Yeah, these were... I forget. They were involved in the Possum Massacre. That, like, labor strike thing? Where it was like the miners was the National Guard. I was back in town like a hundred years ago. Why are they up here? I think these were some of the bad guys. And some of the miners. Didn't want them buried in town. Oh, huh. There's like a few old graveyards up here from the, like, colonial times. I guess there's one up here somewhere too. Well, that's spooky. It just bones. Hi. <sighs> Ancient shark bones. Yeah, see, nothing left to be scary. We're really high up. And really far out. We can see town from here. It's south of us. Find what ridge that is. So are we just supposed to wait here and see if anything happens? You tell me, you're the expert. I guess we'll just wait here and see if anything happens. Nice night. Yeah. I guess why I couldn't see as many stars. That's always that always made me sad. Oh yeah, they're really nice up here. I should knew the constellations like you did. What? You know all the names and the stories and stuff? I wish I could have remembered the them other than I think that one up there is like a bell or something. No, no no no. Remember the time we were all at the longest night bonfire? We spied the constellations together? And you told us about them. All about them. That's the odd thing that, that happened. Oh, maybe it was like a dream or something? God, I can't remember now. I don't know what big constellations stories you dreamed up. Okay, humor me. I'll find the constellations, you tell me about them. Okay then. Alright, buy me some constellations. Wait, are these gonna be real ones or fake ones? Just ones I remember. Or dreamed I remember one time. Ugh. Whichever. Remember Mr. Ch Chaskov? Yeah, so he's teacher. He has an underhill and he has a telescope on his roof. Yeah, he told us he saw some stars through it. That's cool. Tells us are cool. Wish I had a telescope. Okay, let's see. It's a Pope. He breathes fire. Oh, this one's real. Or at least the dude is. Robello. There's a statue of him outside church. Oh, we never went there. Did your family go to church? Wayne's drill is the longest night, basically. I don't think those first two count. Those are like events. Mom works up at the church now. I haven't gone really since I was like 14 or 15. Does she mind? She pretends not to. It's a cat. He's got arrows sticking out of him. And he's chasing a diamond. Oh, I know, so I don't remember his name. He looked, uh, do you remember stories about the forest god? Uh, yeah. My grandpa, my granddad used to tell me Adina stories. Oh, okay, yeah. Hey, his cat was in there. Like, shiny things. Was good at getting through the forest. He was really good at stealing. Oh, yeah, I used to call him Ass Cat when I was little. Well, then he stole a diamond from a king got arrowed to death. 
but he was slick enough that he jumped out of his body and became immortal or something. Huh, decent. Extremely decent. Okay, that's a bell. And the middle is a sigh. Looking at you. Okay, that's a... I know this one's a little, like... Rock, rock album covers. If the one has been rings? That makes sense. It's gonna be really loud. What's the sound in space? I mean, like, basically no sound, usually. That sounds really scary for some reason. Well, at least it means we're not gonna get rung to death by a bell. It's a whale, and it's got like a world on the world on its back. Oh, that's sad. Uh, why? Why does it have to carry the whole world? Like, that's really unfair. <laughs> yeah, that is legitimately upsetting. You kind of wonder why people made these up. I mean, like these specifically. I saw a whale and was like needs to be carrying something. I got they didn't know what the earth was. Yeah, but like, I almost assume everything I don't understand is a whale. You could start. We're like way out here, huh? In the park? Yeah, I guess. Spooky. Oh no, it's pretty safe. And the stars are pretty. So you don't believe in ghosts at all? No, I don't believe in ghosts or gods or psychic powers or anything like that. Not at all? I mean, there's no evidence for them. I feel I've really tried. Did you ever... Yeah, when I was a kid. Tell me about it. So, um... I don't know how much I ever told you. How much critics told you. I did have the best childhood. Yeah, I think I heard that. Why was it bad? Oh, my dad didn't like me. My mom didn't either. And like, um... You don't have to talk about it if you don't want to. No, it's fine. Oh, my dad used to hit me a lot. And my mom was probably worse. She like, wouldn't feed me. Which is why I really like cooking now. Huh? She, like... Shoved, she like shoved me into the pantry and slammed the door really hard. I also fall off the shelves on top of me. Oh my god, Angus! I didn't know at all. That's awful. She thought me in there for like a day at a time, sometimes overnight. So I like tried to develop psychic powers so I could like signal the neighbors, unlatch the door. It didn't work as you might guess. Did you ever tell anybody? I never did. I don't know why. After all, I like started feeling guilty too for some reason. Like this was something bad I was doing. Like being abused, Angus. That's not your fault at all. You were a kid. Uh, don't worry, I know that now. Boy, do I ever. Question: Can I go kick all their asses? Like I've got experience. I can f them shit shit up. Well, I'm almost kind of old now. I uh, saw the visitors sometimes. I have a brother, he's overseas in the army. My dad left like 10 years ago. I don't know where he is or if he's even alive. If he is alive, I don't want to know about it. I guess I just want to give you a hug forever. Well, I was lucky than a lot of kids. I just got in like, yeah. That used to your original question. Testing out my psych abilities in the pantry may be really interesting in both fair and normal stuff and science. I joined a skeptic society, didn't it? That kind of ruined me on a lot of other supernatural proof bullshit, and it gave me something to solve. So you could debunk, or no, I don't know, it saved me a little bit, I guess. Because when someone does all that stuff to you, it can, like, make you do some bad things to yourself. But anyway, yeah, no ghosts are God. So, like, I feel like I've been through that. I'd be more likely to want to believe in God or something. Do you believe in anything at all? Almost like the constellations. Only there's a whale out there. At least the stars exist. I thought people put the whale there. Like, I don't know. We're gonna draw in lines with the spaces between the stars. Like, we're pattern fighters, and we find, we'll find patterns. And we, like, really put our parts of minds into it. And even if we don't mean to. Dive into an universe that doesn't care. People who do. People who do. Pattern finders. I feel like a lot of people don't think they found God. But, like, God found them. 
Like when they were having bad times like you did. God never did. I was completely thrown in the pantry. But a few years later, Greg did. It's like, his eyes could stay up there and not give a shit about us. But Spoil was pretty cool. Here you soon again, smart per person, Angus. I try. But I'm no more than no more than anyone else. Yep. Yep. I should come out here more often. <laughs> yeah. Don't look at him. Who? There's someone standing behind us. In the trees. Holy shit. Holy shit. What do they look like? Tall. Wearing some kind of weird coat. Like a utility coat or something. Oh god. That's the ghost. I'm worried about it being a living person. Sitting in the woods. Staring at us. Oh god, oh god. Well, don't panic. Follow my lead. Hey there. Hey there. Out for a hike. Nice night. He's not answering. That's a little hostile, right? That's definitely a little hostile. Hey! I know what you did! Wait, no. I saw you! Okay, well, we're gonna run now. We need to get to the car. But you're asthma! I got an healer. The good kind, too. No one in heaven and earth can stop me. Okay, okay, okay. Let's go. Deep breaths. In. Out. Alright. Ah! You okay, big guy? I'll be okay in a few minutes. I I'm re resilient. So that was it. That was the ghost. Or, it was some some weirdo who lives out there. They probably get lot got lots of kids on parties back there. I mean, the party we went to, where you threw up. I was too far from there. Why does nobody? What's wrong? Do you need me to pull over? I, and well, let's get you home. No, I need to talk to everyone tonight. What? All of us. I need all of us. Thanks for like coming. Okay, we live here. Yeah, you're in my living room. I'll accept the thanks. It's like, do you have an idea of what's going on? I have no idea. But there's a ghost, and it's after me. I know you guys don't believe me. It's not that I don't believe that something's happening with you. I just don't know if, that, if it's a ghost. Yeah, dude. There's like 50 better explanations for all this. Like what? You have like sudden stress migraines. And you saw something that freaked you out. It makes you stress out. I get migraines. And mate, you've gone through a lot of life changes recently. And, I don't know, stress does weird things to people. Okay, fine, fine, whatever. I'm going up into the woods. I know this thing is up there. I know what I saw. If you don't believe me, that's fine. I'll go alone. You're really gonna hike up past the basketball court? It's late, dude. What do you all care? You don't believe me anyway. I'll go. <laughs> Listen, I don't believe in ghosts, but I believe in you. Ha, <laughs> dude. So let's go find your ghost. I was supposed to say something like that. At least I better. You guys, it's not even ghost hunting season. Yeah, it's Buck. We're <laughs> outlaws. Th th thank you for believing in me. Also, I just don't want you wandering around up there. Alone. At night. Hey, close stuff. Alright, listen to some ghost. Haven't been on a night like in a long time. 
Got this for owls. Why? Owls are cool. Alright. I got work in the morning. Let's go catch us a ghost. How have I never been back up here? Fences work. Nah, people are up here all the time. I came here when I was like 12. What's up here? Just a junk of trees and animals. What is it, babe? Nothing. Nothing? I was praying. Wow. <laughs> really? Yeah, let's go. Wow. Gotta put all this stuff somewhere, I guess. You remember this from when you were 12, Greg? Yeah, I was scared of it. How'd they even get all this back up here? In here? What's up? Nothing. Just like... All this old, old stuff out here. It's here every night. When you go to sleep. So? It's out here. In the dark. So old, so old, so old, so old. So old. Dude, hey, May. I'm fine. We should go back. This is stupid. No, it's fine. Ghost hunt. Woo, fun. Huh? Oh my god. No! Ah, no. Oh, hell, he's awake already. I don't got any juice. No, no, guys. Oh, hell. Guys, guys, wait. Liv, you know, you knew this was going to happen. You at the moment you screwed this whole thing up. You know, you were on the other side of this before. It was a mistake. I owed up to it. Liv, this is you owning up to it. Are I allowed to make one mistake? What mistake? You have the goddamn arm in front of the click clack. Cause you god knows what's gonna happen to this town. What was I supposed to do? Sure screw up. Ah, it's like stuck. It wasn't like yet you could couldn't have called any of us. I panicked okay, I was embarrassed. I'm sure wish you've called me, Liv. You think any of us want to do this? Guys, we can figure something out. Nothing to figure out. But but I got a family. Liv, don't insult us. You know you don't gotta worry about Jeannie and the girls. It'll be completely taken care of. Don't ever want for nothing. He's not gonna budge the legs sticking out straight out. Oh hell. Did the day bring me, guys, you know me! Alright, Dave, you hold him. I'm sorry, Liv. You know we got no choice. And, and, and I appreciate if you stop lying a guilt trip on us. No, 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 no! Hold him still! No! Ah! Hold still, this goy surf! Ah! Alright, he's free. Lurf. Ah! Lurf, ain't no one can hear you this far out. You're splitting yourself to more anguish. Ah! Ah! <laughs> oh, hell, let's get this over with. We should just make this easy, Lurf. Oh, God, this bone's sticking out. <gasps> the hell? Shit! Maple Rolski? Run! Ah, oh, crap, oh, crap, oh, crap. Oh crap, oh crap, oh crap, oh crap.
Nice. Nice. Yep. I don't remember how to play this. It's like riding a bike. I'll just get moving my head when I'm falling asleep. <laughs> I'm like, go over the plots of books I've read. Ooh, look at this smarty. I try to remember every place I've ever been. In order. Wow. Alright, well. So, nowhere from her parents? Nope. Uh, that's bad, right? Yep. Yep. Thanks, guys. I played this until I broke one of the sticks. That's harsh. That was a special time. See you in here. I remember. Sorry about your mom. Thanks. I'm so tired. I could, like, curl up in their bed. There's, like, a whole living area under there. The game has a great soundtrack. Very high school summer. I listen to like half the bands on it. We're gonna see the bank tones in a few days. Or we were. I don't know. Don't see anyone out there. Just wait, he'll be back. So we still have no idea who this is. Uh, big guy, dirty coat. Or several, they could swap out. I can't tell. Get dark earlier. Okay, so, got brownies? Got sodas? What's the brownies? I, I'll make you brownies, man. Yeah? Uh, maybe lasagna. Lasagna? I found one in the freezer. I all the food. You'd eat. Everyone needs to eat. Aren't you, like, scared and worried? Uh, good to embrace everyone feel better. Someone's gotta take care of you. Thanks, Angus. You're extremely good. Uh, no more than anyone else. So the guy you saw in the woods at Possum Jump? Yup. Are those guys... like that guy? Yup, sorta. You got a hat. Huh. I eat the fossil lasagna. Or do I? Do, do you cook it frozen? Guys, this is a bad situation. Yep. Yup. Yes, him. Wait, everybody shut up. I heard it too. Seriously, what? There's someone standing outside the door. What? Everyone be very quiet. Everyone be very quiet. Oh my god.
God is here in this room. I believe that. After this, we can call out. We know that our cries are heard. <laughs> Over here, maybe someone would like to say something about me? That'd be nice. May is my friend. Please, Kyla may be okay. She's really a nice person. If she doesn't know it. I wrote her a part in the movie I want to make. To so kill Watch Witch Gold. I know she appreciate that. Who are you again? Lori Mayers. Thank you, Lori. Anyone else? Mayers is a good girl. She likes to the stars. And, and she loved to hear about them. She... I am sorry. It can be difficult. Anyone else? I always know May as a kid down the street. A little younger than me, but tough. I've been through it in the past couple of years. In addiction, jail, rehab, divorce. And I just think it's not fair. The May of all people should have trouble. Where's that God in that? Where's the higher power? This is all a bunch of bullshit. Thank you, Selma. Anyone else? I'll say something. Maybe Rosky's always been a menace. And I called the police on her more than once. If she wakes up and learns a lesson. That's all I gotta say. Uh, okay. Thank you, William. I'll speak up. Go ahead. Maybe it was a daughter to all of us on the block. Speak for yourself. Tell that folks in, is in the wrong place at the wrong time. I'll find out what exactly happened to her. Oh, we know. Her friends told us. Yeah, they were on the winter night. Down the end of Central Avenue. And someone was out there hunting illegally. And they got shot at. And they fell in. Just fallen off a million things. Things. A million times. Oh, this is the wrong way one time and. Uh, oh, well. Oh, she makes it soon and tells us all about it. She just remembers who done it. I'm sure she. Uh, oh, I'm sorry, I didn't mean to interrupt. What's happened to this one? Do we know you? Are you here to clean up? Nah, it's supposed to fit me fix the door. And here? Nope. Okay, so she's gonna be fine. For today at least, please. What? What? Who are you? Janitor. The house is gone. Me. Oh thank God. What did you say me? It's dead. What's that, honey? Make honey? Everything. Oh my god. May? Oh my god. May? Holy shit, it's May. It's me. She came back to life! I don't think she was dead. Pizza party! I'm feeling woozy. You should lay down. You can sleep in our bed. I feel weird about that. How about the couch? Do I have, do I have to stop playing? No. The sound is good. Once it's okay to keep her here. I'll drive her home later. So just like wander out of her house? Yeah, and all the way here. Jeez. Lucky she didn't pass out somewhere out there. I'm sure hope she's alright. Me too. She's a good person. Both of you shh. So how well do you know this guy? You're a pizza, what, twice a week? At least. We're out by the highway now since possibilities closed now. I thought you two were trying to save money. What? Don't police our lifestyle, babe. Okay, well, just as long as we're sure the delivery guy is safe. I'll just follow him to the keyhole. If it's not him, we'll turn off the light. And I guess hide until we die. Alright, well, as long as there's a plan. Now 
Hello? Look who's awake. It's a it's a pizza guy. Pizza's here. So what happened? We called the cops. You ran and some guy fished you out of the woods. You're like in a coma. Coma. Did you die? I just took a very long nap. Nice. Uh, yeah, nice. I had this dream where, like, a vision retired, time traveled. I don't like it now, consciousness. Can you not eat? You should eat. I don't know if I can. Sorry, Mom. You scared us half to death, honey. Sorry, Mom. I'll come pick you up. N no, it's cool. I'm, I'm just gonna sleep here. Faye is there? Faye is here. Okay. I'll be back in the morning. Have Faye drive you home. I will. May. I know. Give us a call if you need to come home. I, I will. Love you, Mom. Love you, sweetie. You want a body? I can't really eat right now. I get puke, but there isn't anything in there. It's not like puke my actual guts out. Oh, oh right. Do you eat your guts? For a moment, at least. Dude, well, we can. You could say that. When we get out of this, I don't know if we're getting out of this. Well, even if we don't, and we're ghosts, we should hang out more. Deal. What even was that game? Werewolf Shred the Dar 3. I played this at Casey's house like years ago. I played it yesterday. At home. Cool. They got Wi-Fi. Nice. It's like we're a real place. At least within range. I even have a phone because of this place. It's the 1800s here. Hey, May? Yeah? I'm really glad you're not dead. Me too. Yeah. 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 Can we all hit the sack? Cool, I'll be right out. Hey kids, can we do lights out now? I'm gonna drive over. Yeah, dude. Sounds good. See y'all tomorrow. You sure it's safe for you to leave? Safe for me, at least. Nobody's been following me. I was in the woods the other night. Oh, right. I'll keep an eye out. Also, I got mace. You carry mace? This dude followed me home that one time. Alright. Hey, May. Have you had your... What's your name short for? Margaret. Take care of yourself, Margaret. You too, Jeremy. Do you know why I beat down Andy Cullen six years ago? No. We were talking then, and I thought we were to bring it up now, and I was playing this video game. You we were, like, dating ghosts or something. Okay. And I was really into it. I played, like, like 24-7 until this one afternoon. And suddenly, like, something broke. Broke? It was just, like, pixels. The characters on screen, I felt like I knew them. They weren't people, they were just shapes. And our lines were just things written, someone had written. They never existed. They never had feelings. They never would exist either. And I felt so sad. I could just lost these real people. And this whole thing we had, it, it was just me alone. And, like, that realization, like, dumped out on the screen in his real life. One side a tree out front. It was every day. It was like a friend outside the window. It was just a thing. Just a thing that was there. Going in and just being there. The ghost stuff I felt about the tree was just in my head. There was some guy walking by. And he was just shapes. Just like this moving bulk of stuff. And I cried. Because nothing was there for me anymore. It was all just stuff. Stuff in the universe. Just dead. Wow. 
that's... huh. And the same was that softball game. And I know he was the pitcher when I was up. And he was just shapes too. Just signed somehow wrote, someone wrote, like nothing is there. I was so scared and angry, just... oh no. If I knew I was on top of him. Smashing his face in with the bat. Just shapes. Red shapes all over the grass. Oh my god, me. Have you talked to anyone about this? After it happened, they made me go to therapy. With Dr. Hank. Oh god, he's the worst. They made me start a journal. A journal? Yeah, he kinda just said it would help to be able to get my thoughts down. Did it help? Kinda. Sorta. Because this whole thing happened when I'm alone in a new place. It's all shapes. Like back at the softball game. I was doing fine at college for a while. We couldn't make friends. I was just afraid of being outside around people alone. And there was this statue of, like, the founder or something. I have a really shady statue. Like, all rusty metal. It was these shapes. And he was pointing down at me. I was so scared. I didn't leave my dorm room. I hear Denny or AP entire pizzas at once. I don't cost her just to sleep all the time. And finally I got the courage to leave. And I came home. Everything was fine. I knew everyone, and it wasn't just dead shapes watching me. Jeez. Something broke in my head, in my life. I don't mean to be, like, whatever, but... It's like you're suffering from some serious stuff. I, I can help you find some help for it. Dr. Hank already tried. I think Dr. Hank should stick to family medicine dentistry. And half a dozen other things he does. I mean, leave the mental health services to someone else. Like, there are such things as depression and anxiety and, like, I don't know what you're going through. It exists. I I thought when I came home, I just... I felt so safe here. It really made sense for a few days. And then all this. And... And... and shh. It's gonna be okay. We'll figure this out. I'm so scared. I know. We're all scared. We're gonna make it. You should get some sleep. I... Hi guys. Love you. What are you? Are you actually a ghost? Or just some guy? What is this thing in my head? Are you doing this? Why is this happening to me? Talk! Fine, let's do this. Boom! Get away from me, you piece of shit! You're unnumbered, asshole. Uh, it shot me! And we can all use both our arms. I will personally disassemble you. Jeez, oh, Bay. Ah. Uh, Arrow. Uh, oh. You okay? Whatever. You are such an idiot. What were you thinking, coming out here alone? It's all because of me. Oh, I'm sorry. Are you the one putting on a dumb costume and following me around? And can I be fuel, maybe? Is that your fault now? He, he, it's in my dreams. Hey, kiddo. We're out here. Outside your head. Whatever's going on in there, I believe you. But I'm not gonna let you wander off into the woods. To die. No, but... Sh oh, shut up! Would you let me do this? Okay, oh, that's cheating, putting it that way. We're on this now. And if we weren't, I'd still be out here with you. Me too, obviously. Clearly. Clearly we all would be. Listen, I'm all the all the family my dad has now left. I'm for damn sure not I'm I for damn sure I'm not dying out here. And you're God, you're the closest thing I have to a sister. I want you to be gone. So you're not dying either. <laughs> that sounds okay. By me. Well, he's wounded. Sounds like he went back to the up to the mine. Yeah, what do we do? Follow him, I guess. You'll you'll yeah, go. Anyway, 
Yeah, anyway. If it's up in the mind, we might be able to corner him and damn it. Or something. Can you walk me? I I think so. Might be a little slow. I'll hold you if you need it. Thanks, big guy. Alright, let's go do something really stupid. Gates open. Oh jeez. What? You could like block it shut or something. Aw oh, dang, you're right. No. Whatever. It's in there. I have to go down there. Well then. Looks like all of his friends are gone. Just one guy. Just one guy. Just one something. Bing bang. Well, this is a dangerous or anything. <laughs> Nothing to be scared of down here, just a party. <laughs> Not too late to throw ourselves into traffic instead. Looks like he took the elevator down. So much for the Elmo surprise. He's gonna hear us coming a mile away. You sure you wanna do this? Yeah, man, you sure? Guys, I don't know if you understand. <laughs> He's in my head. I can't function like this. Everything's dying or dead already. I, I don't know what's gonna happen down there. Okay then, we'll come out of this together. Oh, that thing looks old. I haven't used this mine like a lot of years. Generations even. Are you our toy guy now? We have Puzzle Spring Tours and Pants Leather Shop. And I get bored. This is the brochure? Well, here we are. <laughs> Wait, okay, I have my inhaler. Oh, I'm fine. It's just like... It's like something huge is on top of me. I mean, technically you're not wrong. Is it like asthma? That's how asthma is. It's not asthma, big guy. But thanks. Shh. I heard something. Down there. You gonna be okay, May? Yeah, I'm alright. We should be quiet. Yeah, I gotta save up for the screaming later. I guess you could just call it a mine, but I kind of wanted to do something. And we're nearing the end of... Door. Door. Tunnel. Whatever. Here we go. Ah, oh, jeez. What is this place? Looks like a church or something. And, like, junk. Oh, God. Oh, God. What is it? It's here. It's here. Oh, God. What is it? I don't know if it's here. It's through there. I know you're in here. Say something. But well, how about this? Take a step forward if you want to die. Show yourself. Yeah, asshole. We're like five times scarier than you. Uh, 
game. There it is. There they are, they're right there! Okay, my controller randomly disconnected. I'm trying to reconnect it now. I'm gonna kill them! Eddie, you do no such thing. It's out of your hands now. You shot me! I say we're even. Loco got shot at the other night. Yeah, sorry about that. You were apologizing? It was a bad call. I'm sorry. It's okay. It didn't actually hit me, so... Wait, what the hell are you? Bunch of old boys doing their damnedest to protect their own and their neighbor. Then why are you trying to kill me? Kill you? I'm always gonna kill you. All you're part of this town. My family relations are just by being hard workers. Contributors. Um, okay. So we could just leave? Well, he brought you down here for a reason. He's not gonna let you leave until he has a say. Well, he's already got an arrow through the shoulder. I don't think he's gonna be having as much in say, saying whatever. Wait, so you think that it... He can't have to get a harvest! He's been in my head somehow. I'm always tired. Constant headaches. He's following, following all of us. He... Little girl. You don't know what this is, do you? What? Oh, God. I've seen this. Or I... I felt it. Was that Skunder and Jim Dorney who found it? Twenty years back or so. After the West Vine closed out past Brittle. Fast humor, last supervisor. Was out there when the company locked off the entrance. Guard his initials and date in the door. And you got this mine. This old one. Old one. I had a proper mine. Big old copper. A bench. Long before any of us was born. Too close to water. And that water was poison. When the first settlers came out here, Old Spring was used, used to be right above where we're standing. But that water dried up. 1992 or so, or, or so, some men from the West Line. Come back here to try bootlegging. Had to build a new elevator. Got the main tunnel cleared. Air front cold. No, no cold. Just dug deeper and deeper. Till it bursts through and that wall and finds this place. And Jim walks right into that hole. And never hits bottom. It calls down to Jim. Jim don't answer. But someone else does. I hear your tough voice, girl. Your dreams and waking times. Which what brought you down here? So what does this have to do with me, with you, or me, or anyone? You gotta understand. Those days it was the end of the world. Job's gone, our kids were leaving. Government didn't care, only wanted our votes. Just put in more regulations, sending jo our jobs overseas. Putting our taxes on lazy people and immigrants. Oh, you worked yourselves to death. Uh, here we go. God damn, I hate this crap. You old dipshits. You finished? I agree with they here. That is seriously st stupid. Yeah, sure. We prayed and prayed up the church, but when Ed Scooter came back down here and listened, he got answers back. Answers? I explained it to a few folks, and they didn't believe it. But he was persuasive. He had the glimmer. When it takes a shining, to, it rubs it off on you. You could do things. I've never seen it. They said it, it could walk through walls. Okay. Edward talked us into all this. At the first time after we picked one out. Well, Ellie was the town home stable. So it's like we were getting younger, and money came too. So few of us left from back then. Picked? First one was Tom Turner, who believed you. Who believe you, me, was a bastard. Just pure trash. We got him down there. And the hole he went. This day, we flowers blew in all over the hills. He told him in the hole? They're feeding him. He's hungry like you wouldn't believe. Every few months or so, he starts singing. It's so I turn. It's someone's turn to find someone. Was that what you were doing the other night? No. What happened the other night was a sham. One of, our one of our number broke the rules and had to pay up. That was a hard thing to do. I think I'm gonna be sick. We never pick no one who's gonna be. We never pick no one who's gonna be missed. That's a solid move. Drifters, drunks, and delinquents. You been? No, God, oh no. Casey, 
the Hartley kid? All he was gonna contribute to society. Just a bunch of kids growing up with no dad. It was a rap sheet a mile long. But whatever sad end he'll wind when have had. Did him a favor. You killed Casey? Oh my god. We don't use that word. You know he was take up business with his cousin, right? You know what happened to his cousin? Burned alive when his old trailer lab exploded. Had to wear hazard suits when they cleared him up. That's where Casey was headed. You killed Casey. You wanna act like we done do him and this whole town a favor? Oh god, Casey's been down here the whole time. It's for his posters. Maybe you should have cared more about him before it came to this. Which one of you did it? Greg. He was my friend! Ah, right, now. Throw it down right now. Or I'll sh I will shoot. <laughs> what if I get you first? Bolt striking right in your eye. Bang. Bang. You probably guns down here? Dangerous as far out in the woods at night. Basic safety. I. 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 Oh, down, son. Don't make this our time. Greg. Dang it! You're monsters. None of this. None of this is happening. We are not monsters. We do it because we love our home. As long as we keep doing this, Possum Springs survives. Things can get better. These fans are going to be humming again someday. Oh, Mills, puff and smoke. You kids don't understand that. We lost what our world was built around. Used to be, a, used to be you provide for a family, bought a house, and you're stocking shelves at the grocery store. Kids leaving more than they're staying. No opportunity here. Old people dying, houses left empty. You ever seen that? Old people become a tumbled in pile of wood and plaster. A job becoming a burned out brick box of, or a hole in the ground. Well, we could change that. We could put this place back together, where it won't be just shapes. Going to die down here. Why are you telling us all this? Because we're getting old, and even with the fringe benefit of health, good health, we need new blood. If the girl is on when we're gone. Really? You're like pitching out us on this? Or maybe even miners back in the day? And have you heard now, financially like? Or is it just some big costume party murder club? For someone shitty, for someone shitty boss who's afraid of dying. That don't matter. <laughs> it does. This is real bad. This is insane. <laughs> Why should we help you? Because no one is here to do this. You remember that flood of years back? You were in the blizzard of 2010? That's what happens. And beyond that, the house never came back. The kids never come back. Everything crumbles. Possibly breathes leads to death. And soon we'll all be dead. This town will just be fields of trees. I haven't seen it. I know you have. I'll say if you need some time to think it over. So we can leave? I was gonna stop you. But understand that you don't know who we are out there. But we know who you all are. I ain't fair they get to leave and I probably get par got permanent damage. Shut it, Eddie. You don't know a thing about what he wants. What he is. I swear to God. Let's go. Yeah, let's seriously get out of here. Son, you leave that crossbow. What? Why? Well, I could bullshit you, but the truth is I just don't trust you. Fine, whatever, it's a piece of shit anyway. <laughs> I, I can't move you guys. I'll carry you. I have no idea what to even think about any of this. It's just horror. That's all which gets used to often. That's all I've got left. Like, everything else in my head is gone. Let's get out of here, fast. I don't know if I... Shh. Talk later. Old, old stuff in here. Okay, I'm gonna have to put you down for a sec, okay? Okay. So, Casey... Yeah. I... Yeah. And for what? I... I think I get it. Well, really? She's trying to explain it right now, but... Like, they lost what they thought was gonna happen. But what had happened long... Like a long time ago. I remember like picturing and things it gave them. And so Casey and that kid at Tarvis are. So I lost it. That's more sense than I can make it. 
You're sad. It's all really sad. You ready to go again, Angus? Yep, sorry. Wait, everybody, shut up. What? I thought I... Holy shit! Is everyone okay? Mate, mate, are you okay? Mate, say something! <laughs> mate? <laughs> it's okay. It's okay, I've got you. He's gone now. Shit, how are we gonna get out of here? Just give her a minute. They're coming from somewhere. So we're not gonna suffocate. Oh, that's a relief. How do you. I was a scout, Craig. I was a scout. Hey, Angus. Yeah. I love you. Aww. Welcome back, mate. You okay? Found out that I almost got murdered. Again. Which is weird. <laughs> that was like the third time in two days. Two days. Two days of charm. Guys, yours coming from back here. Alright, I'm up. You sure? Yeah, I think I can walk at least. It was bored off a long time ago. Can we get through? Let's find out. Let's get out of here. Yep, that's some fresh air, all right. And water. Dude, that's amazing! You can smell water. Hopefully it's not a river. Cave rivers are death traps. Mine river. Right in a mine. Right. Hmm. I can see the bottom. I don't think we're gonna die in the, in the one foot of water. Right. I know what you are now. I think I knew before, but, you know, that I sent that kid to the hospital years ago. They said I had an anger problem, but that's not true. I was saying because of something else, something I'd lost. I'm trying so hard since not to be angry. Coming all defenseless. I lost more and more and more. It's not getting better. I want to be angry. When I ran home from college on the bus, I had to stream. Maybe I saw it out the window. Last sleep on the tree. Finally blown off. I'm so scared. All the time. And the fear hurts. Feeling like everything is over. It was over long before I got here. So long, hiding. I'm trying to outrun this. I get it. This won't stop. Until I die. But when I die, I want it to hurt. When my friends leave, when I have to get let go, when this entire time was wiped off the map, I want it to hurt. Bad. I want to lose. I want to get beaten up. I want to hold on. Until I'm thrown off. And everything ends. And you know what? Until that happens, I want to hope again. And I want it to hurt. Because that means it meant something. It means I am something at least. <laughs> Pretty makes me something at least. You know I can't understand you, right? Oh, shut up already! I know this won't save me in the end. But I don't need it to save me forever. I just need to save me now. So if you're going to kill me right here, then do it. If not... May! Dude, you okay? Whoa. You got a sleepwalky sleep there for a sec. Good way to cure you. No, I think I'm good. I just... Very, very tired. Hang here for a bit if you need to. We're safe. Uh-huh. 
Hey, there's light over here. Do you smell that? I bet he did. What is this? Might be better or something. Keep the miners from stuff game way back when. Looks old enough, at least. For sure. Hello! We're down here! Don't ask us why, please! Okay, look and someone's out here in the woods at night. I, I can try to make it out. No, I can, like... Okay, yeah. Okay, yeah. Are you up for this? Yeah. I don't know. I'm, like, all hyper now. Like dolphins. Hyper like dolphins? No, like, when your body is like, uh, whoa, I almost died, and you get all hyper because you're filled with dolphins? Okay, I'm seriously confused. Are you okay, May? Endorphins. Ah, okay. There, thank you, those. Oh, well, uh, okay, well, find those dolphins up out of here. Uh, that's assuming I can even do this. We'll watch. Okay. This place, huh? I have a charm. Yeah. What are you doing out here? I live right up, right up the hill. I heard Greg yelling. You're all stuck down there. You were at the bottom of the old well in my backyard. It's been a really bad night. Sounds like it. Got any rope or something? Yeah. Can you go get it? Hey, May. Yeah. Was that? Was that Germ? Yeah, he's getting some rope. What is he doing out here? He lives here. In the woods? <sighs> I can tell your body hurts. That was a long way. I'm not upset this. You're the best, Germ. Eat the sugar and caffeine. Oh, uh, anyone else want to get far away from this well? Yep. Germ, can you, like, kind of sail this well? Hmm. I got dynamite. What? Yeah, I mean, I can get some. How big an explosion is that? I mean, not small. Okay, that works. Thanks, Germ. Oh, thanks, buddy. Um, okay, bye, guys. Here goes a weird, weird guy. You saved our lives. Germ's good. Germ's a good man. It's strange that we all we just murdered all those dudes down there. How do you figure? Well, I mean, the elevator's broken and we can't cause the cave in. That was self defense, I guess, but we did cause the death of like a dozen guys. No no, no they're also alive down there. Oh god. Yeah. Jeez. Well we're blaming us, they attacked us. One of them attacked us. So we're worrying about like it's morally grey. We're not murderers! Like, if we had a choice, we wouldn't have done it. I would have. Uh, what? They, like, killed people! They were trying to get us to kill people! Screw them! I don't even believe in hell, and I hope they all go straight there! Jeez, Angus. Well, that's what I think, at least. And yeah, it's like that trolley thing. What trolley thing? Okay, that's funny if we keep walking. Hey guys, uh, are you there? Anyone? Okay, I'm gonna type anyway. Hard for me to say anything smart about what the hell just happened, even happened. Easier for me to get out all out here. Yeah, I need to talk. If you jerks are off doing whatever. None of us asked for any of this. It didn't happen to us because we're like special. You can work as hard as you want, but the universe is gonna keep doing what it does. I don't think any of us deserved all this. This is all stuff that I started that started long before we were born. It's all like moving so fast and you're dropped into it. And you're just trying to grab onto something. 
All of your work kept me from floating off tonight. Also, you kind of killed that guy to save me. Don't think I didn't appreciate that. Lol. I don't know if I'm ever going to understand what what ha all just happened. I hope it stopped. I just feel right now like all I want to do is wrap my arms around all of you. Not just because I love you, but to keep you all together with me. Wrap into a ball and no one could hurt us. Sorry I'm rambling. Germ buddy? Germ, you, didn't, you don't even use Messenger. I guess just typing at you whenever, wherever you're at. You're like the most stuck here at... Stuck here out of anyone I've ever met. But you're the least trapped. That's some beautiful shit, dude. But you're definitely something. I'm so sorry about all you've gone through. I understand all your problems. But if I could fix them, I'd fix all of it. And I buy the tools to do it from your store. Or like borrow them at least. I've ever friend would buy, but I'm what you got. And I'm glad. Yep, there it is. Now I'm just gonna erase all that. Oh shit. <laughs> Guys, I was just kidding about the whole lot thing. I, I really tired. I don't know what I'm saying. Log off me. Log off. See you guys next time.